Right, we're all hooked up. The weather's left it to the uh, very last day to start raining, which uh, yep. I thank the weather gods for. No, we've had some good here. weather, haven't we? Yeah, so this is the end of our little tour. A big tour. It's been three weeks. Three weeks. Three we've weeks. been away, yeah. And uh, we're out the gate. And we've really, really enjoyed it. Yeah, just leaving Stamford. Yeah, which has been nice, isn't it? Yeah. Three days we've had Three here. Three days here. Not really sort of explored the Stamford area apart from the. Um, Kirby Hall. Um, but yeah, did you come back here? Yeah, well we've been here before haven't we, yeah. this site. Yeah. The only thing about it is there's only like two service points aren't there, it's a bit... Um, yeah, yeah so there's, there's a the motor home. one yeah. and there's another one and there's 84 pitches isn't it? Yeah. So yeah. this could do with perhaps another one, I don't it, know. It's not, it's not been not, a problem. No, it's so what's been your favourite sign? Uh, well, I like Sandringham at the beginning. Yeah. yeah. Um, and Towton Mill. Yeah. This one third, I think. Yeah. Um, enjoyed that first night at Clumber Park, actually. Yeah. Because uh, we had a pitch round the side we've not been round before, didn't we? And that was nice. Yeah. Um, least favourite, I mean, I suppose. And again, it wasn't the site's fault, it was just the noise there. Thetford. It was Thetford Forest, yeah. yeah. Yeah, that was a shame, wasn't it? Uh, yeah, so I've never been there, although, you know, I used to look at it on the late availabilities when we were down south, and often I think, oh, I'd like to go there. Yeah. So a little bit disappointed, but... Yeah, I wish we'd explored the, uh, the broads, but we couldn't get into the... The broad site, could we? No, no, so I've got that booked for next year. So I think um, yeah. when we go there, we we'll go to some of the places we remember from boating holidays yeah. that we had there. Yeah. Yeah. So that's that's it, basically, and then we'll put together some photos where we have a. We'll do a little photo, photo montage. Mont yeah. And then uh, we're home for a bit, and then we're. Looking oh, forward to Scotland. To Scotland, yeah. Yeah. yeah so, touch wood, no further restrictions. No, that was what we were waiting for yesterday, yeah. wasn't it? We were sort oh, of no. expecting some uh, some restrictions. It never happened, did it, really? Not for campsites. Not for campsites, it? no. It's for visiting families. No, and we're not planning on visiting many many families or anything like that, so... No, no, so... As far as we know at the moment, we're OK to go, don't we? Yep. Yeah, unless anything else changes. Unless anything else changes, yeah. in which case yeah. we'll let you know. Yeah. So we're going A43, um, A47, A1, M62, aren't we yeah. now? Yeah. yeah, that's basically it. Boring way home. Boring so let me home. let me thank you for watching. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, give us a thumbs up. Remember to subscribe if you haven't already, of course. Hit the notifications icon, you know the stuff. And uh, here's a little photo montage.
Right, on this trip we've done 661 miles and average consumption 25.7 average speed 39 miles an hour been travelling for 16 hours and 54 minutes so message financial controller <laughs> how much does it all cost the whole tour costs £1,057.14. Right. And you broke it down into... I broke it down into categories. I did myself a project yeah. um, in my money tracker. Yeah. Um, Thor's no Norfolk tour, yeah. right? So that I could just get these particular transactions out. Yeah. Then I've given them a category, okay? Yeah. So... Food groceries total was three oh three thirty four because we did three shops. Three shops. So we would have done that shopping anyway. Would have done that anyway. Yeah. So you know, that's what we did anyway. Yeah. Um, we bought two guidebooks off English Heritage. Yeah. One at Castle Acre, one at Kirby Hall. Yeah. So they came to seven pound fifty. Yeah. We had to put some fuel in the up because yeah. we were going to various places in that. So at Tesco's in Huntingdon, we spent £35.11. We spent £2 on parking charges at Sherwood Pines. Okay, when mm -hmm. we stopped there. Um, for the motorhome, we got two lots of fuel. We got one at Sainsbury's in Biggleswade and one at Tesco before we left. Um, so that's how it was, 140 one Yep. We had a few meals out, mainly at cafes, lunches, things like that. Um, that came to £107.80. Yep. Um, site fees, uh, which we we pay, you know, paid yep. either a deposit or we paid the final balance yep. when we got there, uh, they came to £461.38. Yeah, and that's for how many nights, is it? That was four three weeks so it's 20 nights i think it was was it yeah right okay so it's an av what's the average then just over 20 pound a night yeah. isn't it yeah yeah okay which yes. comes to a grand total of 105.714 right um, so, so i mean it's about 700 pounds if you take off groceries, groceries which we normally would have to spend anyway. anyway yeah yeah so that's interesting because i've now got this project so I can sort of filter out what each tour does. Yeah. So, so thanks impressed. for that then. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>